I hope the film is important. I think class is everywhere in this society. I think you feel it and this is an invitation to come in and see uh, how things look from the other side. I like making fi films about loss of innocence, about young people who are exactly where they make really important decisions that will um, last a lifetime or the consequences of those. And, um, and those three scripts that I've directed back to back about young people uh, are strong, they're witty, they're about um, people I care about, even if some of them are better than others. Not the films, the people. <laughs> and the films. <laughs> I think I wanted to become a film director when I found out that that was actually a job that I could stay in the cinema always and turn that into a, a way of living. And uh, it's I've, I've worked very, very hard for many, many, many years. I'm not sure if I had known it would take that long that I wouldn't have chosen something differently. So I'm glad I didn't know. And I'm grateful to all the people who've helped me do what I love to do. The play is about a dinner in this secret uh, elitist society and the film is more about the fall in this uh, society. The, uh, when they start in school, how the initiation process, how you become a member of, of uh, the riot club and also uh, about um, how what happens when you end up doing something you shouldn't have done. Uh, it's slightly elaborated uh, around the play. Uh, one character, Miles, uh, the main character who you follow into this riot club and, and um, his girlfriend Lauren uh, have much more emphasis. Lauren isn't in the play at all and they are your, uh, they have different moral values and they are your uh, guide into, into this world. The film is inspired by real clubs, real event, but not by specific people. Uh, Laura Wade, who's, who's written the script, has created a club of her own with their own rules, own initiation process, own language, um, own menu. And, um, and so she thinks she's researched it very thoroughly in order to make her fantasy create these things. And, and I prefer it that way. It's not meant to hurt anyone or make, it, make fun of anyone. Oh, someone I respect, someone whose ju judgment I think is worth um, listening to, someone who is good at crisis, someone who's friendly, someone who doesn't support the class hierarchy on a film crew. Um, someone I can laugh with, uh, someone I can trust, someone who loves film. There's always an element of dogma in what I do. In, in the case of the Riot Club, it's, uh, you can see it here and there, you can see it in the editing, you can see it in the way um, the actors sometime uh, take a little shortcut or a little detour or do something uh, that's lively in a way you cannot create if you don't always keep uh, a little door open for something that is out of your control. Um, and it's much more fun to work that way and it's, uh, it takes courage but I think it pays back when I see the film now and I can see uh, things that only happened once that are uh, sitting in the film and, ha and have a sense of life they couldn't have had if I didn't have that dogma experience somewhere in my luggage. <laughs>